cold but it is rainy and yucky outside anyways I just wanted to mention a little something I don't know if anybody else struggles with this but when it rains um, and I'm, I, I'm pretty sure it's from my accident mostly um, but days where I can my body can tell you if it's gonna rain or snow <laughs> anyway trying to get up I have to be to Bridger's class at 845 if I'm going to help um, and so, holy crap though, I'm like trying to get up and I can barely walk and getting in the shower, I'm really sore and doing my physical therapy exercises. I'm, oh, it's just rough, a rough morning. And so finally I get out of the shower and I feel like I'm kind of warming up and make my smoothie and anyway, got the kids out the door and I kept Theron home today because we're gonna go home, go, go home. We're already home, guys. Anyways, we're gonna take him to go get his hard cast on his broken ankle, foot. Anyway, um, so the verdict is, we don't know for sure if it's broken. The x-ray is hard to determine because it's, if it was cracked or anything, it would be on the growth plate. And the doctor says that the growth plate looks a uh, growing growth plate has um, kind of a thicker line on it. If it was a fraction, it, a fracture, it would have the same appearance. And so, anyway, the doctor is basically saying that we kind of go on him, on Theron, and his ability to move around and what he's willing to do and what he's not willing to do, the swelling. Um, he also said that a fever with a kiddo is an indicator of a fracture, which he definitely has. The swelling tells him that it's a fracture. Um, the bruising also is another indicator. So everything is, and I don't finish my sentences, I know guys. Anyways, but he also refuses to put weight on it and um, he won't use it. And so that's also an indicator. He says that most kids definitely know their limits and just kind of watching him and seeing what he is willing to do and what not willing to do. Um, all the indicators tell us it's broken, so we're gonna go ahead and take him in and have it casted. Um, he said if it was a sprain, he definitely would have started walking on it by now. And so that's kind of what we're doing. And yeah, I feel like I should put my body in a cast. <laughs> just kidding. I don't really feel like that, but I am so sore today. Ibuprofen is my friend this morning. Uh, I don't know why it's so hard on rainy days. Um, but yeah, that accident, my legs are throbbing. Um, I don't know, I think I'm just, we're just gonna go ahead and tell our story. <laughs> I make references to this accident. You guys have no idea. If you're new to our channel, you don't have any idea what I'm talking about. And so I think we'll just go ahead and tell the story, make a vlog out of it so I could just reference to it when you guys are asking questions. Just be like, here, watch this. <laughs> Anyways, um, so that's kind of what we're gonna do today. And uh, I do I do need to put up our vlog from the weekend. Um, I think I'm gonna go ahead and do vlogs on Tuesdays and, or Mondays and Thursdays is what I'm gonna do. Um, Mondays are gonna be probably Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And then Thursday blogs will be Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and mostly Thursday. So anyway, I just think that that's probably the best way to do it. I gotta find some consistency or our numbers are never gonna go up. Anyway, so we're pretty crazy and so there's never a down moment in our family. You know, the full house Lyman's. <laughs> what color are you picking? Green. Green. I'll take a look at 
Come by. Greg, how you guys doing? Pretty good. How are you doing? Have a seat anywhere, and then, Farron, guys, this is Dr. Williams. He's my Hi. It's all good. I give you this. You're just going to show that to my secretary just as keep the pre, I think, the previous appointment in two weeks. Okay. And that's just a prescription for the little okay. sandal that goes on the bottom of this. All right. And then, Theron, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to steal. No, we only Could have you cut me maybe two of the two inches about that long? We'll put it on this. This is just going to be a cast that we're going to put on now just to make it easier for the day and get around and do everything. I kind of hang on to these ace wraps and just put them in the medicine cabinet somewhere. Splint, you're not going to need so much. And then I'm going to put this on um, nice and neat, and I'll have a um, little sandal. But even though it'll feel cured and ready to go, um, I would kind of keep them off of it for about 30 minutes. It's okay. like fiberglass and cures a little bit, and it's hard and it's fine, just a little sticky. But if you walked on it right away, it might be a little soft on the bottom for 30 minutes. Give him about okay. 30 minutes, then it'll be itself. And then just like before, so he'll be able to walk on it after. Yeah, that, that's what we're looking for. That the end point to this is he just wasn't getting off his crutches. Well, that's what we're saying. Like, you know, okay, yeah, it's kind yeah. Of my guesstimate and his preference. Well, that's fine. But if he, it doesn't work, yeah. then then that's why I was telling you. And if he's not just kind of walking a little bit more and okay in two days, then put the cast on. Yeah. But whether you call this. A bad spring. That's for farmers. That'll be just like this. Whether you call this a bad sprain or a non-displaced fracture that we just can't see on the X-ray, if it's a sprain, you'll walk, you'll want the cast off in two weeks. If it's a crack, and fair, let's do this. It's just that you heard it. Yeah, if it's a crack, you'll want it on him for four weeks. Okay, but the treatment's exactly the same. And then taking it off, we'll talk about it on the next visit. Now, Theron, what makes this work better is we're going to let your knee come down. And then, Lorena, do you mind? Go ahead and get your other glove. I'm going to have you. Here's what I want you to do. I don't want to hurt you, but I want you to pull your foot and your toes up as high as you can. And the reason is you don't walk on your tippy toes. You walk with your foot flat. So can you pull that foot up? Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. And I might just cover your, your mm -hmm, toes. That's and fine. It won't go quite yet. Yeah, that, that hand right mm -hmm. there is essential. So you just let it relax there, and if you'll pull your toes up just towards the ceiling as high as you can and cup the red, it'll just feel better. There, and I'm going to slide you forward just a little. That's fine. And then just keep that knee bent. I keep your leg. That's great. That's just so I can get back behind you. Are you ready to stay real? Yeah. I, I, I'm, I honestly, by clinical exam, if I had to bet, I think he's got a little crack in there. We just can't see. It's just because he's still pretty sore. Thank you. Hey, Theron, when you take off that cast, your head, your leg's going to be hairy like a Wookiee. You know that? <laughs> he's exactly right. You'll have a Wookiee leg. Oh, yeah. Really will. Well, the Ewok running around. <laughs> You'll be a Sasquatch on that side. Yeah. Warm, buddy. Oh, there you go. And then we figured those were just the two inch side. That would be perfect. I agree. <laughs> Is that what you remember from when we took your cast off? Yeah, my hand was so freaking hairy. It still is kind of hairy now. <laughs> That's funny, huh? <laughs> and then there, this cast is safe and all, but it's a little bit sticky for 30 minutes. Is what I was talking to your mom about. So I just wouldn't play with it much till I till I could get home. Okay. Not bad, but it's just sticky and messy. And again, pull your toes up just all the way. Now is the time. All right, maybe jump right on up there. Where do you go to school? Eat a how? Eat a how? You like eight? He's six. He's six. six. He's in kindergarten. My son started kindergarten with a cast. Oh. Oh. Mm -hmm. Well, he got lots of hugs yesterday. <laughs> All the girls are trying to help him out. Heck yeah, huh? <laughs> yeah, he, uh, tell him to kiss my cats, baby. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, he, uh, was just opening up my practice. Pull, pull your toes yeah. real high down for me. There. Way high to the I'm sky. Like that. Can you pull that? Yeah. 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 And I'm going to be right there. All the way. Let's do this. 
Ouch. Ouch. Us, <laughs> you okay? It doesn't hurt. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. So he was in a wheelchair the first day of school, and mm -hmm. people were teasing him. And he started getting <laughs> grumpy and started chasing people around, running into him with his wheelchair. Count for 30 and we hug. <laughs> there, and you can make your cast camouflage. We we'll need a brown marker and a black one. There you go. Color it, huh? There you go. Well done. You gotta improvise, Mom. My, bro my son broke his arm in high school when I was in chiropractic school. The surgeon said, Well, what color? And he goes, Well, it is Breast Cancer Awareness Week. Let's go pink. Can we do just like a pink ribbon? on a purple cast because the school colors were purple mm -hmm. so when he woke up it was pink and then he folded the or it was purple all the way up his arm and then he folded the pink in half and rolled it all the way up it <laughs> and this kid did pink just because he i don't know why girls liked it girls liked it girls like pink real men wear pink <laughs> <laughs> answer that kid Can you answer him first? No, tell him I'm recording. And he can't even flip me off, so. <laughs> now, I just want you to sit here for about two minutes and let this get good. It'll heat up a little bit and all. It's just hey, designed sorry. to be tougher, firmer, or more support for just being able to walk on it. Um, and don't worry about it today, but my hope is tomorrow he just forgot his crutches and really starting to do more. That's just a That's sign. Awesome. I think uh, this is soap. It just makes it seal a little bit. It'll kind of go away here in just a second. And I think I have an appointment for you in two weeks. Mm -hmm. and one or two things. He'll come in, and if he's just, hey, better, but it's still pretty sore, then probably about four weeks in this cast. Okay. He might very well come in at two weeks and say, oh, it's a lot better, and I've worn my cast. And he'll be able time. to feel the difference, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Here's the deal. When people ask me literally when do the cast come off in this age group, I say when he wears the bottom of it out. That just tells me it doesn't okay. hurt and he's walking. It's just a guesstimate of when yeah. it won't hurt to come off. Okay. And so when he wears that... I'm gonna let him sit here for about 30 seconds. Now you do have to keep it dry, so bathing is more just being supervised a little bit more than normal, and that's fun to bask around. Or if you're like my boys, it's not it's not spring yet. So, so is he gonna need a boot months. at first? No, the, the, the this, this there isn't a boot. We call it the boot just for adults, the removable cast. It comes oh. on and comes off. Okay. We just don't have one in children's sizes that works okay. very good or whatever. What they were talking about is we're gonna get you a little. Theron has a little song that he wants to sing. Ready? Go. I have my cast on. I got my cast on. I got my heart green cast on. I got my cast on. I got my hard gal cast on. Argyle or hard green? I said hard green. Oh, hard green cast on. You guys have seen the song that the Shaytards sing for their socks. That's where he's getting that little tune is the Shaytard Socks song. And I changed it. He changed it to cast hard green cast on. <laughs> nice. Nice job, buddy. <laughs> what are you going to do down there, Theron? <laughs> what a dork. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching our channel. We really appreciate it. Um, and share us share us like us or thumbs up or whatever you do on youtube and um comment below let us know what you think and um we'll try to i don't want to put up anything vulgar however i do once in a while just try to keep the swearing down to a minimum we are an lds family but we're real i'm sorry i have a potty mouth that's my downfall and unfortunately i can't control the kids when they turn 16 and above so once in a while you i might miss uh, Austin swearing. Austin's new thing is flipping me off when I have the camera because he doesn't want to be on the vlog. Once in a while I can get him without his middle finger. So that's our downfall guys. We are an LDS family but we are not perfect. Anyway, thanks again for watching. We'll talk to you. We'll see you guys on our next, uh, our next vlog.